The civil war in Yemen is weighing on European markets. The deal's Laura Board joins us from London with that and more. Laura. Thanks, Jen. Yes, investors already had enough to worry about with the Greek debt crisis here in Europe. But now concerns are rising that Yemen is becoming the location of a proxy war in the Middle East between Saudi Arabia and Iran. Oil prices are up sharply in, um, on fears that the conflict there will disrupt supplies. Airline stocks, including international consolidated airlines, the parent of British Airways and Iberia, Lufthansa, the German airline, and Air France KLM are down sharply today. Tech stocks here in Europe and also in Asia have taken a tumble on the back of that weak US durable goods data for February. Losers here include a ARM in the UK, ASML in the Netherlands, and Infineon Technologies of Germany. Here in London, London Stock Exchange is down sharply on news that Bursa Dubai has exited its eight-year-old investment. It's sold 17.4% of the company. It hasn't actually said what, how, what it priced the shares at. Reuters is reporting that they changed hands for 2250 pence. That's down from the current price of about 2330 pence. Bursa Dubai would have raised about $2 billion from the sale if that price report is correct. Happy news in London from for Supergroup, the fashion retailer. Its shares are up very sharply as it's an, announced very strategic initiatives following on from its shock October profit warning. Among these, it's spending about $33 million to wrest back the North American license to sell its super dry products. It's also tying up with the actor Idris Elba, who rose to fame uh, through the role of Stringer Bell in The Wire. Idris Elba will help it design a premium uh, line of clothing which it plans to market in North America and elsewhere. That's all from me. Back to you. That was Laura Board with The Deal in London.